Hello everyone, how are you? Welcome to today's video. Today we are organizing my small kitchen pantry. I do not have a big kitchen pantry by any means. We are working with what we got. <laughs> um, the last time I did this was back in February, so it's been about seven months now. And the setup I used last time was definitely helpful and the organizing containers were super handy too. I'm so happy to be organizing this again, putting things back where they belong, restocking the pantry. So without further ado, my friends, let's Let's get started. I am starting this off by removing all the containers, bins, and baskets, finding little hidden goldfish gems my professional mess maker Teo has left for me, and then I'm gonna wipe it all down with 7th generation all-purpose spray, and it's in the scent Morning Meadow. I've said it before, I'll say it again, I love this product, and this smell is so delicious. <laughs> Here's that goldfish mess Teo has so generously left for me. <laughs> this drawer is like his little drawer. We have our lower cabinets baby proof with this magnetic system and Teo has his own magnets. So when it's snack time, he can come and grab something for himself. Um, we really enjoy this magnet system. So if I can find a link, I will definitely add it to the description box. On to restocking some items for the pantry. When restocking, I prefer to put the old contents at the top and the new at the bottom. It's almost like a first in, first out type of situation. That way I know that the old is being eaten before the new. If you guys have not tried these heavenly hunks, oatmeal, dark chocolate cookie things, oh my goodness, you guys seriously need to. I buy these from Costco, but I've seen them in smaller bags at grocery stores, one of them being Walmart, I'm pretty sure. Um, but my littles love them. They're vegan, they're gluten-free, free of glyphosate, and it's non-GMO verified. <laughs> Stay with me, take a chance, baby, run the dice gotta give me some love cause when i'm with you i'm in paradise you know how to make me feel alive gotta give me some love nah nah gotta give me some love nah 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 gotta give me some love nah 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 you gotta give me some love nah 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 gotta give me some love nah Thank you. 
restocking some brekkie items like oatmeal and cereal. I do want to put out a PSA that I did wash these cereal containers prior to restocking. I had someone comment some not so nice things last time because I didn't show myself cleaning the containers. <laughs> so yes, they're clean. I just don't film that part. <laughs> Cause when I'm with you, I'm in paradise You know how to make me feel alive Gotta give me some love, nah, nah Gotta give me some love, nah, nah, nah I do want to touch on the containers I'm using. I picked up a box of 12 OXO containers from Costco. Um, I believe it was $50. Don't quote me on it, <laughs> um, but it was a crazy sale. If you pay attention to your local Dollarama or dollar store though, they have awesome options for bins, containers, and baskets. Actually, the baskets that I have here are actually from my local Dollarama. And honestly, Dollarama is so underrated. If you haven't noticed, Dollarama is actually carrying items from HomeSense at a fraction of the cost. So keep your eyes peeled. <laughs> Posting pictures on the gram so other people know that we're more than friends. And ever since you came around, I've never been sober, always in my head. Met you at a time when I was so low, went from just talking to taking you I am checking expiry dates. These taco seasoning packets, I usually get in bulk at Walmart. Typically they have the sale um, four packets for $5. So I'll usually stock up, but these expire in 2023, 2024. So again, I'm putting old to the front, new to the back. And once I'm done with this, we are gonna go on to reorganizing the pantry and put everything back. Okay, my friends, that is everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. I would love to have you. And to my returning subscribers, thank you so, so much for your endless support. I seriously appreciate each and every one of you. And I will see you all here in a brand new video next week. Bye. Bye.